Yes. After the first hell collapse, we were, we were back in there trying to bring people out. We knew the second one was about to come down, but we were lifting one person, and when it came down, we all just ran for our lives. You could hear the rumbling when you looked up, you could see the top of the building just crumbling. We all headed south, and you could feel the wind hitting in the back. I couldn't see everything was totally black. You were just walking, hoping to find daylight. It was just unbelievable. I never seen anything like in my life. I just, I'm just thinking about the firemen I see going up the stairs behind me and looking at half of this building. I don't know. A horrible day in the history of the city of New York, for that matter, the United States of America. This is live. Uh, from several miles away. That is what the New York skyline looks like, absent a huge landmark, the World Trade Center. But with that uh, plume of smoke uh, that has been present all day long, and the uh, preceding piece of videotape is why they call members of the New York City Police Department the finest and members of the New York City Fire Department the bravest. Um, there will be stories of heroism that come out of today, and we will be hearing about for quite some time. There are people alive.